Miss Queen Emma Chocolate 2018, Dewey Pauline Harry, says she purposely joined the pageant to promote education. Miss Harry shares the same sentiments of the MPIP PNG to empower women through education. Hailing from East New Britain, the autonomous region of Bougainville and Central, the 25-year-old is an intern pharmacist with the Department of Health. Miss Harry acknowledged companies like Paradise Foods for allowing young women like her to share what they were passionate about. Education, I believe, is the key to empowering young women to becoming confident young leaders in our country and, of course, for the future of our country. MPIP PNG is a not-for-profit organization that supports young women through the MPIP Scholarship Fund. So far since 2011, it has assisted 204 young women nationwide with tuition fees. In 2015, Miss Abigail Havora made history for PNG to be the first Miss PNG to be crowned Miss Pacific Islands. Miss PNG 2017 Nia Wally Twine, while sharing her experience, said the pageant was not necessarily a beauty pageant, as it is publicly viewed, but was a pageant with a purpose. But I can by now say that it is not just a beauty pageant, it is a pageant with a purpose, a pageant that sees young women like me and many others and see the potential in them to becoming more than what they really are and give them that opportunity to speak for themselves. Miss Queen Emma Chocolates 2018 will be wearing the Baiwa label by designer Natasha Tamanabai. She brings the number of contestants to five. Sponsors of the other four contestants are Pogera Women in Business Association, Century Hotel and Rapopo Plantation Resort, Medeng Resort and the International Training Institute. Charlene Airy, National MTV News.